eventually our inland cities into the low 80s. Back to you. All right. Thanks, Rosemary. Well, thanks for joining us this morning. We've got some changes coming up. We do. Coming up uh, right now here on KTVU, the Fox 2 Sports Weekend Show. Mark Cabanas will sit down with Raiders head coach John Gruden on a one-on-one. -on -one. And our morning news will continue at KTVU Plus at 9 a.m. until 10 o'clock. And then later to today, you see you got the Niners and Vikings. So sorry, that game is at 10 a.m. Seahawks and Broncos at 1 p.m. And then you have the KTV News and Sports Wrap at 5. And well, of course, all the latest news on KTV. Of KTV.com. We'll see you at 9 over on the Plus. In 2011, California passed a law requiring carbon monoxide alarms in single family, in single family homes. That was seven years ago. Carbon monoxide alarms typically last seven to ten years. Which means California is about to start hearing a lot of this. But you can beat the beep uh -huh. by getting a new kit at Carbon Monoxide Alarm now. Beat the beep by going to your local Walmart to find the kit a solution that's right for you. Dave <laughs> Meteorologist Bill Martin, now Sunday on the 10 and 11 o'clock noon. It's been many years since expectations have been this high for the 49ers. Jimmy G is the man who started it all, and he'll be joined by a former foe, Richard Sherman. We will preview with all the 49ers what lies ahead. The Raiders and Rams will be the finale of week one of the 2018 season. That means Oakland will face the quarterback with Bay Area roots, Jared Goff, 2017 Coach of the Year, Sean McVay with the guy on their sideline who sports the scrunched up face. They got an old saying around here, once a Raider, always a Raider. I got him. Raider fans, are you still buying that? We'll find out as the Raiders open on Monday night, John Gruden at the helm and lots of controversy surrounding this team. This is Mercedes-Benz Sports Weekend. Prince, the color purple, the purple people eaters, Minneapolis, could all those things go together anymore? Well, the great uh, superstar Prince was a big sports fan, and I'm sure he grew up watching, you know, the Minnesota Vikings and the purple people eaters that could have been an inspiration for that song. Hello again, everyone. Welcome to another season of the Mercedes-Benz Sports Weekend. I'm Joe Fonzi. And I'm Marky Bonnie. It's glad to have you with us. And uh, Joe, you think it's true? 49ers expectation level many years since it's been like this no question about it and the one thing that made that all happen it was a very busy offseason for the 49ers but they put on the top of their list sign that